Kentucky. Very interesting news article that I ran across. Uh, this was over at Saturday Down South. Now, obviously, it's been reported at a bunch of different places, but Kentucky has five football players that are going to file or have already filed a lawsuit against the Lexington Police Department. Now, this is from Eric Woods over at Saturday Down South. Five Kentucky football players are reportedly filing a lawsuit against the Lexington PD after being charged with burglary, but later cleared. So, this story is bonkers. The police say, and this is all from the article, the police say that the group of Andrew Phillips, Vito Tisdale, Reuben Adams, Juton McLean, and Joel Williams were asked to leave an Alpha Sigma Chi fraternity party on Forest Park Drive and being involved in a fight, accusing them of, quote, forcing entry. It says the police also accused them of having a gun. Uh, the players said that they thought it was an open invite. Uh, apparently, they were called racial slurs. They were told to leave. They said that they were jumped when they were trying to leave. Uh, according to one of the lawsuits, the fraternity was picking out names from the Kentucky roster as they filed charges. They didn't actually know the guys that came to the party. They gave all this to the police. The police actually went and arrested all of these different guys that may not have actually been there. Like, it's just insane to me. Um, but it says that the police used unreliable information in the accusations against the players. How this turns out is going to be very interesting. Now, everybody knows that college police departments, uh, it's very, very interesting. And it's at least college town police departments. Uh, the fact that football players were actually arrested as opposed to them just giving this information over to head coach Mark Stoops and letting him handle the discipline, that was interesting, right? That's that's where this whole thing gets a little crazy. But I'm, I can't wait to see what is going to come out of this because, man... Uh, if they find a way to successfully sue the Lexington Police Department, what is that going to mean going forward? And the fact that they've already done this, they've already filed a lawsuit against them, um, you might see more arrests in Lexington. Just throwing that out there. Because that's something, you know, when somebody gets a, a grudge or a vendetta against somebody or another group of people, uh, you start to see things just tailspin drastically. So I'm sure this is not something that Mark Stoops wanted to have to deal with, but here we are. Here we are. It's going to be something to pay attention to going forward. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app and make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter at GaryWCE and the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.